Hello everyone, welcome back. This is John RMS, aka Ace Bullion, and today, yep, I have another review brought to you by the Silver Trader. Um, it is something that is, well, if you have the children in the room, you may want to get them away so they don't end up taking your bullion. <laughs> Equally saying that, if you have a soft spot for animals, definitely look away now. But before I begin with that, um, just very quickly, I would like to say that Monday is the day that I plan to do the live stream. The timing is not yet confirmed. Um, that is something that I'm still working on. I really am. I'm trying to get as many of you guys as possible in on this and also what is suitable for myself. Um, as today, I've been pretty much almost unable to do heckish much after working with my CNC machine. Um, I really wanted everyone to know, you know, things happen, you know, I may or may not be able to do something at a certain time. Uh, but Monday's the day. Um, the fallback day is going to be Wednesday, but we're going to put Monday on the calendar to do the draws to get them out and to make one heck of a show and make nine people incredibly happy. Um, and I hope that you're gonna be there to join me. So I will be uh, letting you know what time will be appropriate uh, for myself, uh, most foremost. Um, apologies about that, but really it's a case of, as you may or may not know, I have a broken back. It's really difficult for me to move about and to do a lot of stuff. And, you know, it's 20 to two right now in the afternoon. And I am only just getting over <laughs> the pain, but enough about me, enough about me. So what do I have? Well, oh, I have a very, very, very exciting video for you guys. So let's have a look and let's see. Okay, get this thing out of the way, shall we? All right, here it comes. We have dun, 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 another fantastic South African uh, coin is, I, I believe it's the BH Myers Mint. Um, and well, this is the back. This is the money shot. This is the coin to be called. And this is a series. Now, obviously, I'm not going to show you the, you know, the money shot here per se, apart from, well, unless you want to say that's the money shot. But let's, uh, Let's zoom in on the back because um, it's something that I think is just super cool. So we have the bank name there and there's no way um, it says Bank Nakuru uh, U, uh, Rwanda. Um, and I'm pretty sure that, you know, translates to, um, you know, the Republic of uh, Rwanda. I think... It is simple and just elegant in itself. This coin kind of caught me by surprise. And not just for the coin, but for the attention to detail. Now, it has a reeded edge all along, as you would find with you know, most American silver eagles and all sorts of different coins like, like that. Here's one of the kickers. It comes already sealed in its own protective capsule. Um, now this can be a turn off, but it can also be a really good, you know, indication to say, look, you know, at least these were produced with quality and care in mind. So they're already sealed, they're airtight, I like that. Um, many of you, like myself, may decide that, um, you know, you want to perhaps, I don't know, 
take it out and put it in a, a capsule. Um, but to me, this little pouch here, no, I like it. So here's the thing that you're going to be, okay? Are you ready for cuteness? There you go. We're bringing on the Bush Babies. Oh, yeah. First off, from a glance, this is a, a glance that you may have without bringing it closer to your view. Um, this is, you'll have it in your hand, you'll have it, you'll have a good look at it. Um, and it is, you can clearly see the outline here and all the attention to detail with Africa. Superb. You could also see 2020, and I will zoom in. We'll have one ounce fine silver. And then we also have, uh, you know, African ounce. That's a bit weird. African ounce. Hmm. So, but it does say one ounce fine silver with three nines, 2020. So let's first start off by taking a look on the top. So I do like the fact that they've actually sealed it. And it's really difficult. So you can actually get my fingerprints in there. <laughs> but let's see if I can zoom in a bit more to see any of the wording on here, which looks like it is backwards. In some ways, I'm not sure if it is or isn't. No, I did have it right. Just something uh, apparently I cannot speak. But yeah. Here we have BNR. Bravo November Romeo. And we'll zoom out slightly here so we can have a good look at this coin. There's the cute bush babies. Look at that one on the bottom. Look at that little cheeky smile on its face. <laughs> I like it. It really is cool. I think what they've done is that they've really brought... Um, and I apologize for the light on this one because it is in a protective uh, gloss ca you know, case. But not only have they gone through and, you know, with any kind of pop-up design, they've, uh, they've gone through, they've outlined it. Um, but they took extreme attention to detail with every little aspect of this coin. Um even down to the font, um, the font is, you know, a bit unusual, but refreshing. Uh, that's something that I definitely say. And, uh, yeah, it is super cool. And then, of course, you have all of the terrain, mountains, and rivers that run through Africa. And... It's not like they've just kind of taken taken a like a blank image uh, of Africa and stamped it on. Note they decided let's make it more special. And you know I applaud uh, the designer on that. I think it really does. It, it is super cool. And you can actually just slightly as I'm doing this feel it uh, the raised surfaces on um, the coin itself. Now I find that I I found this just really cool. African ounce. What does that mean? <laughs> it, it says it's one ounce of silver, uh, but African ounce. That's that's a new one for me. Um, in fact, what I might do. Let's see here. I'll uh, potentially. I'm gonna get out my scales. And bear in mind, this is gonna be in uh, the packaging so there's going to be more weight added onto it anyway but not not a significant amount by any means um but you take a look I mean, look at those bush babies they are absolutely just charming um and i uh, yeah I, I don't know what to say everything from the weeds down to every little bit it's just super super awesome and let's have a look here at the the mother for a minute. I, I presume it's going to be the mother. Look at that. It's just grabbing on to that little 
tiny bush with uh, his bottom feet and the hands are holding on. Super, super cool. All right, so I got out his Troy laid out in front of me because I'm just curious. With the packaging, we have over an ounce. We expect that. Uh, just over 1.065. So minus this packaging, yeah, I would say it's, it's probably bang on an ounce. Or as near enough to it as you're going to you know, ever get. Um, but yeah, that is super, super cool. Something that I didn't really expect to like. I just really want to show off this terrain. It is so beautiful. But I mean, that's a cute money shot there. Especially if you're an animal lover. But overall, styling, brilliant. Series, yeah, definitely love to see that. And, uh, just elegant and simple, uh, you know, on the reverse here. And it's, some call that the face because it's face value. So, you know, you can never really win uh, with how it's named. Um, everyone's kind of stuck to their own opinions on that. But this one here has this, a rather special place. It is just super, super sweet. And, and they've actually done the little bush babies justice um they do look remarkably they're not cartoonish or anything else um if if you google you know what a bush baby looks like yeah you're gonna get this image this is how cute they look um uh, and you know it, it's just something that is brilliant i love it you know um now as far as collectability, yes, okay, there is a series of these. This is going to be one of these kind of coins that you're going to either collect or not. There's no mintage on them, so there's no limited numbers or anything else. But as far as how it's packaged, the designs, the elegance... Yeah, this is definitely one for the records. This is one to keep and to say, hey, look what I got, you know, um, because who knows what will happen in a year's time. These things could fade out um, and then suddenly be a fad and, you know, very collectible. I don't know. Um, it, it is one of those kind of, you know, pieces of silver that you're going to treat yourself to if you want to buy it. And uh, this is just super awesome. So what's your comments? What's your thoughts? Do you like the fact that we have a very mirrored finish and then fraud? It's kind of a, 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 and I've used this before, kind of like a metallic chrome like with then you get the matted, you know, silver in the background. Um, they don't, the bush babies stand out, but they're not as matted because they, they do have, uh, raised elements of, you know, some gloss thrown in to, you know, to give it highlights. So yeah, and I'm just super curious to know what's your thoughts. I mean, I like it a lot. I think <laughs> that little cheeky monkey. A little cheeky bush baby. It is super cool. And then, you know, as I said, you can see the large bush tail coming through. But yeah, so let me know what your thoughts are. Let me know what your views are. Uh, as I said, I will be uh, doing the draw on um, Monday next week. And we'll go from there. But I will keep updating you guys as far as I, you know, as much as I can. And I am still open to feedback. I've had a you know a few people say what times are best for them, but again, you know the times have to work in all directions. And sadly, I don't think I'm going to be able to cater for everybody. So, 
Well, there you have it. That's my review. I definitely give this, you know, absolutely two thumbs up beyond a shadow of a doubt. It is just, just so super awesome. It's cute. I got to put this back before my kids see this because they will want them. I could assure you that much. But, yep. So, please leave your comments down below. Uh, please make sure that you like, subscribe. Uh, if you want to see further content, uh, more coin reviews that are coming, I can tell you the next coin review I do have is another rather cute animal. Uh, so, you're going to want to stick around for that. And again, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for supporting me and my channel. Uh, make sure you go visit the Silver Trader and also go visit acebullion.co.uk. And that way you can uh, check out some of my hand poured silver. Uh, I look forward to actually doing some live videos or just some little videos of me pouring uh, some silver to come. So thank you again very much. And I hope you guys have a great day wherever you are. As always, bye for now.